हेलो एवरी वन मैं सेल्फ अमी मेहता एंड इन ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम देर इज अ इंटर प्रोसेस कॉम्युनिकेशन सो बेसिकली हाउ वी कैन यूज मैसेज पासिंग इन इंटर प्रोसेस कॉम्युनिकेशन सो लेट इज डिस्कस वॉट इज मैसेज पासिंग इन द इंटर प्रोसेस कॉम्युनिकेशन एंड दिस इज बेसिकली अगेन used there are various method that can be used to uh, create or to stay mutual exclusion which means when one process are executing in the critical region no other process can execute that particular uh, section so which is called mutual exclusion so to prevent mutual exclusion there are various method and one of the method is message passing method so again there is one problem which is producer consumer problem there are uh, various methods to solve producer pro, uh, consumer problem either it is a sema for variable using monitor then using a signal and wait method so there are numerous method to solve producer consumer problem so basically what is producer consumer problem is that producer is produce some item and put it into the common buffer and consumer consume that consume the item from that common buffer but now there is a scenario because producer and consumer are sharing one common buffer what if the buffer is full then producer cannot produce the item and put it into the buffer same now what if the uh, buffer is empty so consumer cannot consume the item from that empty buffer so what is the message passing let us back to the message passing so this method will use two primitives which is send and receive so this is used to send message so uh, send in bracket destination and message so in above syntax destination is the process to which sender want to send message and message is what the sender wants to send so basically this is the syntax of the send message that the destination and that content of that message now second one is receive it is used to receive message so in receive source and message so this in this syntax source is the process that is send message and message is what the sender has sent so this two primitives is used in message passing method so this is the uh, algorithm for solving producer consumer problem using message passing method again we already discuss what is producer consumer problem now let us discuss this as we said that there is one common buffer in which producers put their items and consumer consume the item from that common buffer so buffer is nothing but this something like this memory so there is a total number of fixed slot so here we are defining variable n is 100 which is nothing but the number of slots in the buffer now let us see the producer procedure what happen in that so first of all one item is taken and one message buffer is created which is message m now we are continuing uh continuing checking so while true generating something to put in buffer so for that producer produce item so item is equal to produce item it nothing but it produce some item and store that item into the item variable now for receiving message there is syntax receive the process name and the message buffer as we already discuss so what here we write receive in bracket 
कंज्यूमर कोमा एम्पलजन एम सो बेसिकली इट इज वेट फॉर एन एम पी मैसेज टू अराइव सो द मैसेज विल बी सेंड बाय द प्रोसेस कंज्यूमर एंड द डेटा विच इज मैसेज एम सो इट इज बेसिकली वेटिंग फॉर एन एम टी मैसेज विच इज अराइव फ्रॉम द कंज्यूमर नाउ इट बिल्ड अ मैसेज एंड सेंड टू द अगेन सेंड इट टू द कंज्यूमर सो इट इज द डेस्टिनेशन एंड इट इज द आइटम सो इट बिल्ड मैसेज एंड सेंड इट टू द कंज्यूमर ना वॉट एपन विथ कंज्यूमर ना इन कंज्यूमर अगेन वी डिफाइन ए वेरिएबल आई एंड आइटम एज इन टीचर वेरिएबल एंड मैसेज बफर एम नाउ वी आर सेंडिंग द नंबर ऑफ टाइम्स एंड एम टी जस्ट बिकॉज द टोटल नंबर ऑफ स्लॉट्स इज हाउ मच इज एम टी फॉर एग्जाम्पल टोटल नंबर ऑफ स्लॉट इज हेयर इज हंड्रेड सो एट इनिशियल स्टेज फॉर आई इज इक्वल टू जीरो देर इज ऑल स्लॉट्स आर एम टी सो इट विल सेंड टू द प्रोड्यूसर एंड मैसेज बफर बट एज द फोर लूप इज इंक्रीज द नंबर ऑफ स्लॉट्स डिक्रीज सो इट विल गो अप टू हंड्रेड विच मीन्स द लूप कंटिन्यूज फ्रॉम जीरो टू नाइंटी नाइन एंड इट सेंड मैसेज टू प्रोड्यूसर विथ मैसेज एम विच इज एन एम टी मैसेज अगेन हियर we are uh, going into continuous continuing loop now here the consumer receives the message which is sent by the procedure the producer so it will send by the producer and it receive from this message and now it extract the item from that message and it will send back an empty reply to the producer so it will send producer and m person m now it uh, consume item from the buffer and uh, it can do whatever that consumer want to do okay so this is the whole scenario of producer consumer problem with help of message passing so again there are various method with uh, using message passing or using semaphore using monitor using signal and wait we can solve producer consumer problem basically the concept is as we are sharing one common thing one common file one common procedure one common database two procedure or two function cannot access at the same time of some Uh, part which is critical region so for that there is a requirement of some uh, condition or some algorithm or some lock that when one procedure is executing in critical section no other process no no other process can enter it into critical section okay thank you